am doing sugar cookie stars, something classic and simple, and something equally as simple for the packaging. I get to decorate gingerbread cookies and they smell amazing. I have gingerbread cookies to decorate and they're one of my favorite cookies. I also have a really pretty packaging idea. I have the best cookie packaging idea, but first I need to decorate my sugar cookies. I'm just gonna use a zigzag for my candy cane. It's really easy. You can't mess up this pattern. It's just like my glue at home. Ah! Do, do, do. Oh no, dripping. I'm always glad when a cookie recipe is easy to bake because I have no time. They really do smell great. I'm just gonna put a little red sparkle at the base of the mitt. Come on, how cute is that? There we go. <laughs> Turned out not as lovely as I had imagined. I'm just gonna try some yellow buttons. <laughs> this is impossible. How are people good at this? We normally decorate rooms, not cookies, just to be clear. Oh yeah, tastes like the holidays. Oh, that one excites me. That one, I like it. So now I'm gonna let these dry and then we're gonna get onto the packaging. My packaging idea is the easiest. Step one, paper crinkle. Stack your cookies. And then, use your cellophane. Gather the corners. Ah, oh, I should have cut my ribbon. Son of a Always cut your ribbon before. This is really a two-person job. This is so cute. I'd be so happy to receive this. And I love the decorative bowl. It's a classier take on the holiday mug because nobody needs another mismatched mug. So I have a final product here that I'm actually pretty proud of. After a little bit of practice, I got a few cookies that are looking pretty good. So the cookie packaging that I've come up with is a way to really show a beautiful paper on the inside of a box, and it's super simple. I'm just gonna cut two strips of paper. Based on the box, it's probably smarter to be precise so that there aren't any gaps. That will slide very easily into this part. I'm just gonna put some filler along the bottom so that the cookies have a nice little nest. When you open up the box, these cookies are gonna be such a cute little surprise. Then you can seal it with a nice little note. So my cookies are drying, and my idea for packaging them is super simple, just like the cookies themselves. The first step is to glue two sheets together like this. We made a template like this, sort of lining up the base of the bag. So you just take the one that you've made, there we go. And then you use a kitchen knife because it's not as sharp and it's not gonna cut through the paper and you just score. And those become your folding marks. And now you have your little form that sits right inside the cellophane bag. This is probably the hardest part, right? I'm gonna use the knife to get it in there. It's very crinkly. And then once you get the cookies in there, they'll sort of push it down in place. Voila. I am so proud of myself. I think I really am Susie Homemaker. And my cookies turned out great. Slide them right in, and they look pretty. And then to finish it off, you go with a beautiful bow. I chose a velvet ribbon. My gift wrapping idea is the noisiest, that's for sure. And there you go, I think it's cute as a button. My cookie packaging look is like a take on origami. There's a lot of folding and it's all about pretty paper. I'm going to draw some lines as to where folds are going to go. I'm just cutting away the corner pieces that are left over. Now we'll make some diagonal folds. Then we'll fold these whole flaps in. Now we're gonna take these flaps and tuck them into these pockets that we've created. And flip the whole thing over and come back up. Now we've got our basic shape and package ready to go. We're gonna punch some holes in the top. We'll thread the ribbon through now. Now we'll grab our cookies and put them in a cellophane bag, scrunch the top and place it inside of your frame underneath the ribbon, and then we tie a bow. So we've got these pockets in the front that we can put other goodies inside of, like tea or a gift card. And there we go, here's the packaging. We'd love to hear what you think. Let us know whose cookie packaging and cookie decorating was your favorite.